Hello again, YouTube. Welcome to, or welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> I wanted to put out a video on the lug hitch in the um, Matt Lux vegan leather. And I have mine in the color pearl gray. Um, the fabrication is so unique and different. It reads like a canvas, but it feels, it feels kind of like vegan leather. I don't know. It's softer, yet also seems a bit more durable than your average vegan leather. I really like it. Um, and you'll notice too that um, the lug patch or the lug um, logo on this bag is a patch and it's the first time I've seen this. Um, I, I like it on here. I think it looks nice with this fabrication, this bag. And then also um, they put one of these like little decorative hangy things on this first zipper which is removable and it's removable so that you could attach something of your own if you wanted. I like the look of that there though. I never thought that I was going to like be big into this fanny pack uh, belt bag trend whatever um, but I am and I actually really like the way that this looks across the chest. Um, I also have one of the Lululemon belt bags and I did not like the way it laid across the chest. I wear that as a normal belt bag, but this bag here I wear across the chest. And if I can figure out how to insert a picture of me wearing it, I will do that for you. So let's get into this bag. Um, this first pocket here, super smooth zippers, by the way. <clears throat> This first pocket is a built-in wallet, which I do utilize here. I've got my cards in there. There are six card slots, um, and I've doubled up some that you could double up easy in, with these card slots. And then they have a cash slot here behind them, which is currently empty, but that's where it would go if I had cash. <clears throat> and then I've also stuck in here a little card holder. Um, this has like extra cards in it, but I'll use this to bring into like a gas station with me if I want to pay with a card and I don't want to take the whole bag. I'll just put my ID and my debit card in here and bring that in with me. And then I have this tiny little mesh pouch that's holding my um, breath strips and any other little miscellaneous items. Like if I decide to take off my earrings or rings or something, I have a spot for them to go. So that's what I've been using that for. This is Lug's signature phone pocket with a magnetic closure. If you can hear that, with this um, Matt Lux fabrication, the lining of these um, cell phone pockets is more of a almost like a velvety feeling, as opposed to like the, the felt that's in their normal uh, regular fabrication bags. It's really nice, and I'll use my phone case here to demonstrate the ease of access and all that so it does my phone which my phone is an iphone uh 12 mini and it fits in there with no problem whatsoever and it has plenty of space which i'll move this over as far as i can i don't know if you can see there is like a good two inches here of room so definitely for sure your larger smartphones will fit in here no problem so that's where i store my phone when i carry this bag 
And now we'll move on to the inside, which is what I am so impressed with, with this bag. I mean, it holds so much and the way that it holds it is so awesome. Like, I just love how my things are like in this bag. <laughs> The zippers go down a good amount, like, so that it opens up pretty, I mean, very wide. Like, look at that. It's just so nice. It just pours open. And, it, I mean, it doesn't literally pour open. Like, you're not going to lose anything. Gosh, I'm so sorry for this windy wall. Oh, forgive me. Um, but anyway, so... This is what it looks like when you open it while it's on the body. I'm gonna turn it back around though before I start taking stuff out. <clears throat> so first here are my keys. They are attached to the built-in uh, key bungee, key leash. Really nice to have one of these. I love, I love when my bags have a place for my keys. And this is a pretty substantial uh, bunch of keys and like keychains and stuff on oh, my big O key ring so that was on the key bungee there and then I have this this is my lug Metro XL so they have a regular version that's smaller than this but um, I'm using this to carry like insurance cards uh medical insurance cards and and my appointment cards and stuff like that super roomy little pouch has an id spot on the back it's nice i really i, I enjoyed these these metros thoroughly the, both the xl size which is this size and the regular size this pattern is dragonfly multi which is actually an older pattern that has been recently brought back by Lug. And I'm very happy about that. I'm here for it. I really like it. And the stitching on here, oh, I love it. It's like a mermaid stitch. I don't know if that's what they call it, but it looks like mermaid scales. So there's my Metro XL. Behind that, I had my little uh, notebook, which I use to write down my grocery lists and um, like little uh, reminders and stuff. Anything I need to write down, I write down in this little notebook. I have my little silicone pouch, which I'm just using for my cosmetic items. So in here I've got some perfume. I got this little atomizer on AliExpress and I just filled it with some of my perfume I have here at home so I could have it with me on the go. Very handy. I have some Orgel just in case. And then I have lip products down here. So my everyday lipstick and a couple backups too. So this one. And that one. I really like this little pouch. It is silicone, but it's quite substantial. It's good quality. And it's got a little ring on it here. If you wanted to hook it to your keys, you could. Nice. Okay. Then here, I needed a way to carry loose change since I was utilizing this front part as my wallet. This just is holding my coins. I can hold quite a lot of coins, and this is just a little tag for it. Kipling. Very nice little pouch. You could use this for all sorts of stuff. 
coins is one of many things that this would be useful for. I love the zipper on here too. It's super smooth, nice chunky zipper. And pretty cool little zipper pull there. It says Kipling on it. And it even has this little lobster claw clip if you wanted to clip it to a bag or something. It's really nice. The outside of this is like rubberized, like the it looks like a rubber stamp on a fabric background. It's cool. <laughs> okay, so now we can get into the pockets. There are two pretty large bungee elasticated pockets on the back wall here. Um, we'll start with this one. I just have my little portable pill case. It's cute. It's pink. Got this from AliExpress too. This holds a lot. Got just my headache medicine, some aspirin, some Tylenol, even carrying some Dramamine. You all, and like vitamins and stuff. The other day, I was driving, and I had to drive a far way, and it was all windy roads, and I got car sick driving. I didn't think that was possible. Like, I didn't think that was something that could happen, but it did happen to me, and it wasn't just a fluke, because it happened another time before that. And that first time, I thought, well, I'm just, I just don't feel good, you know? But then it, when it happened again, I was like, no, I'm getting car sick while driving. Crazy. So anyway, I carry Dramamine just in case, which I mean, I know it's, it makes you sleepy, but I'd rather be sleepy than feeling like I'm about to just vomit while I'm driving. So yeah, carry Dramamine, carry everything just in case I need it. <clears throat> and then the only other thing I had in that pocket is my AirPods. Look at this case. Look how cute. There's a little puppy. It says my puppy and it's like, see how it's like 3D? I think it's supposed to look like a little package of like food or something. I don't know. I just thought it was too cute. And it came with this little ring that you can use to like attach to stuff, your bag or whatever. Super cute. Love, love, love that case. <clears throat> I do wish, though, that I could have found it in pink. I will say that, but it's still cute. Okay, now this pocket here. I'll just take all of this stuff out here. So I've got a lighter, my mild liner highlighter. I have my Lug pen. This came from Lug. And the, and the pattern Camo Midnight. Uh, oh, this is supposed to be like a little... It says it's to clean your AirPods. And I'm sure that it has that capability. But I'm kind of confused how to use this. It looks like... If you knew what you were doing, it would be handy. <laughs> I mean, some parts of it I understand. Like, there's a little brush here, and this is fuzzy. Sure, it has a purpose. And then a pokey thing, I guess, to go in and dig around and get dirt or earwax or whatever is lurking in your AirPod. In your AirPods. I don't know. It didn't come with any instructions. Got it off AliExpress. Thought, oh, I'll be able to figure that out. So, let me know in the comments if, um, you know, if there's, like, something I'm missing with this. I mean, I'm, I'm sure that you just use this to dig the stuff out, and then you can use a little brush to, like, brush the little pieces of crap away. I don't know. This part is what really throws me, though. Like, I don't know what that's for. It's fuzzy. You see? 
Anyway, AirPod cleaner. Allegedly. Uh, this is my a little uh, disposable vape and a Tide to Go. Y'all, please forgive my nasally sounding self today. Allergies are just oh, awful right now. Both of my little girls are sick. That's actually what took me so long to put this second video up as I've been dealing with sickness and just either not feeling like sitting down and filming or not having the ability to because I'm taking care of two sick little babies, little girls. So forgive my nasaliness. <clears throat> um, and then the only thing, the only other thing I had in that pouch is another one of these little mesh guys. And I just have some tampons in there, like the tiny little tampons that are more uh, like travel friendly, I guess, because of their small size. So got those. Okay. Now, see, here's the uh, the label. It says lug, and there's the name of the bag. It's called the Hitch. Look how pretty the lining is, too. Uh, gosh. Any other time I'd be able to tell you the name of this, no problem. But it's escaping me since I'm sitting down to film. Regardless, it's gorgeous. And then on this other wall, the front wall here. This is a clear view pocket. I have my uh, compact mirror. And some nail care stuff. Some cuticle cream, nail glue, clippers, files, uh, stuff like that. So it's everything that this main compartment holds. And my, my, you all. That's a lot. It really is. For a, for a belt bag, bum bag, fanny pack whatever however you say it for a compact bag i just think that that holds so much it's really nice i really 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 love it and i highly recommend it um but i do have one more pocket to show you which isn't that exciting but it's cool that it has this extra pocket here on the back and in here, what do I have? Oh, I've got a spare key. I think this goes to my husband's toolbox. He likes for me to hold on to things so they don't get lost. And then, oh, just one of these like hair tie things. And that's all of it, guys. Love it highly recommend it. I really wanted to get this video out um, as quick as I could because I know Luck has just released this style bag in this same fabrication but in a bunch of new colors. Some of them are like like pastel or like bright summery colors. I have my eyes on uh, on like the light purple one. I think they're calling it Sugar Plum Ice Pop. Oh, it's so pretty. I would love, love, love to have this bag in a fun color like that. So anyways, if you all are interested at all, I would get on Lug's website, luglife.com, or on the app, Lug Live is what the app is called. Instead of life, it's L-I-V-E in the app. Um, I'd get on there and then QVC. Which, I don't know if they've hit QVC yet with the new colors and stuff. But definitely, definitely check it out. Um, if any of you have um, this bag and would like to comment on it, I would love to read your comments. Um, thank you all so much for watching. I'll try to get more content out to you as soon as I'm able. Take care.